Hello and welcome back to Josh to the YouTube. Today we're going to be doing a little over the top fix for all of you. This is probably one of the most common mistakes in a golf swing is that over the top move gets a little bit nasty from the top, starts out left, common shot for that slice um, and it's just an ugly one. You do not want to be hitting that over the top move and for a lot of people that are in that kind of mid to high handicap. This is probably where you're at. You've got a club path that's over the top, your face is open, you're not quite getting that pure contact. So today we're gonna to do a really quick and simple drill, how you can feel that club shallow and get inside. So from the top, you might make a good backswing and then from here, the first thing that happens is the shaft steepens, comes over the top and then you get that nasty move. So what I want you to do is swing to the top Put the right hand on the grip here and then just flatten the shaft. That is just going to put it behind you and shallow. And then from here, you're just going to turn and look at how beautiful that is. Now we can just turn onto that golf ball and hit that nice little tight draw that we all want. So literally put your right hand to the left side of the grip if you're a right-handed golfer. Swing to the top. Right hand on the grip. Push it down. Flatten that shaft, swing down to here. Look at it, it's just beautiful. And from there, you're gonna hit some nice little tight draws. So what I would do to rehearse this on the driving range is I'd go to the top of the golf swing, right hand, as I said, flatten that shaft, turn down, feel where that club is now. You know, do that a couple of times and just really slow it down so you're feeling where that shaft is in relation to the body, hands, everything. Um, it might be a really, really strange position for you to feel if you're someone that's quite steep. Um, and then what I would do to rehearse this in a full golf swing is I would then swing to the top, right hand, lay the shaft down. And then from here, I'll just go and hit a few little soft three quarter shots. And if you have any way of checking your club path now, that one there was 5.97 inside club path, you know. So from where that over the top swing is, you know, you're probably looking at maybe a 5.6 over the top path. If you start to recognize that that's where that path needs to be to feel inside, then you can have some clarification of where it is to make a good golf swing compared to that over the top move. So sometimes all you need is that little feeling of getting that shaft inside to, to really solve all your problems, you know. Um, from an over the top move, you know, sometimes this right shoulder gets active. It could be a grip problem. Um, you know, it could be even a, a, a limit in turn that, you know, you can't get that full backswing um, that's causing you to go over the top. So there's loads of different reasons and sometimes all you need is a little bit of a feeling here to get that shaft on a shallow plane. And then, you know, you've got that inside club path. So give that a go. It's just a simple, quick and easy drill to feel something that's not over the top. You know, to fix something in golf, sometimes you've got to go to the opposite end of the spectrum, go out on the driving range, try and hit some big old draws. And then you start to understand that, you know, you've got to find that balance in between the two. If you're hitting big old slices, go to the range, hit some snap hooks, you know, get the ball turning right to left and then find that middle ground. And it can be all as simple as just finding that little drill to get that club inside and hit some good golf shots. So quick and easy video for you all to try and fix that over the top dreaded golf move. So please be sure to like and subscribe and we'll see you all for the next one.